It's Showtime 60 represented the final show for the promotion, and it took place right here live on Fight Network. Battling for the 85 kilo world title in the main event were Jason Wilness and Brazilian fan favorite Alexandro Pereira. As the fight got underway, Wellness seemed happy to simply stand in the pocket, showing very little footwork. At the beginning of the second round, the house lights went down, bringing the match to a screeching halt. When the action resumed, Wellness was able to drop Pereira with a left hook to the liver. Pereira made it back to his feet, but was quickly sent back to the mat with another body shot. Only this time, the lights went out yet again. After Pereira benefited from some extra recovery time, Wellness really turned up the intensity, dropping Pereira with a leg kick that proved to be the deciding blow. Wellness takes the final It's Showtime title fight via KO. In the co-main event of the evening, Dutchman Steve Port squared off with 93-fight veteran Tiago Michel. This fight maintained a staggering pace right from the outset, with both men refusing to back down. Michelle was dead set on utilizing his spin kicks, taking every opportunity he could to throw them. Port, however, was unfazed by his opponent's creative offense and continued to press forward throughout the fight. In the end, Port's tenacity simply wasn't enough as Michelle notched win number 94 on a judge's decision. In a lightweight matchup, Hafid the Hyena Al Bustadi took to the ring to face off with Wallace Lopez. The two exchanged significant strikes in the opening round, but after Al Bustadi dropped Lopez with the right hand, he began to up the intensity level. It almost cost him the fight as his aggressive style saw him get caught with a left that opened the cut on his head. The fight was allowed to continue and Al Bustadi began chasing Lopez around the ring, taunting his opponent to engage. The fight was sent to the judges' scorecards where Al Bustadi's aggression was rewarded with a decision victory.